Ah. All right, what's up, Deadbeats? And I just did that live, and I cannot take that back. So my name is Dan Brock, the Deadbeat Super Affiliate from Deadbeat.com. And just let me know how we're doing with the audio, if it sounds clear, if you're hearing it through both ears. Not just one, but two. So my name is Dan Brock, and I just need a quick little update here. We'll start in just a second. want to make sure that we're good on sound. Just give me a little chat box. Yes, a rebob. All right, we got, this. we got the thumbs up. Okay, guys, so what we're going to talk about... See video with no sound. Okay, test one, two. Just give me one second, guys. I'm going to have some issues here. Just got to verify this in my massive control panel. Test one, two. Okay, it's good. Okay. Okay, I apologize for that quick dead space. So today we're talking about what you can do to profit tremendously in bad economic times. So I've been through these before and there are certain niche markets, certain topics that do really well and there are strategies that you can use to really overcome to come out of this larger instead of smaller. Do you know the feeling? We feel like you're just kind of, you're slowly kind of becoming stagnant and kind of pushed down, but this is what you do to expand and become more abundant. So how's everyone doing tonight? I hope you are good. It's about 7 p.m. and we're jumping into the live stream right now. So I want you guys to take a quick look at things on the old interwebs here. These are just some articles that I picked up off the internet and I think I'm gonna help make my point here. So this is from Bloomberg.com and basically I just saw this about an hour ago. The Connecticut governor says that uh, commuting to the to New York City from Connecticut, uh, Connecticut is going to basically be stopped. So that means that 30% of all office spaces will probably never be used again because people are going to be more accustomed to telework. So what that says to me is that more people are going to be getting used to working online. And once you taste that fruit, the magic of working from on, working from home, it's very, very hard to go back. If you've ever worked from home, have you? Isn't it nice to be away from all the nutbags out there to never to constantly get to avoid having like confrontations over the most petty, minute details ever? Well, once you taste that fruit, it is very, very difficult to go back, right? Well, this, this is what has a lot to do with this training and why I think digital products, ClickBank products, and other digital networks are going to really thrive in this time in the uh, current crisis here. So number two, we got Amazon ramps up hiring to over 100,000 people. This is about a couple, was this like a, a couple a couple weeks ago. What that's telling me is the online platforms are really, uh, really thriving nowadays. Here's another one. Uh, so unemployment will reach 25%. This is from uh, Goldman Sachs does this. So people are losing jobs. Here's another one. Twitter, Twitter allows people to work from home forever. Same with Facebook. Most people will be working home from 2020. Okay, so again, where I'm, where I'm going at with this is that the, the general population is now going to be so used to working from home, it's something that will never go back. So that means that if you start your business online, whatever it may be, it could just be a, a, a Shopify store, it could be an Amazon affiliate site, which I don't really recommend nowadays, but you're going to be right in front of that wave, no matter what happens from this point on. Let's say, let's say next week the whole virus ends, but people are still going to have those habits that they've built in. So let me know, if, let me get a one there in the chat box if you can just hear me, if you agree with that statement right there, if you agree with the overall uh, concept of what I'm looking for. Okay, sound is good. Looks like a little laggy on the picture. I was reading there were some errors with that. I apologize, it's a, it's a bit laggy. Uh, there's something to do with the new OBS version. So give me a one in the chat box if, you, box if you agree with what I'm saying and I gotta solve some way to get this choppy internet. And okay, all right. So here's the deal. Right now, there are topics that are doing really, really well. Which camera am I? I got two cameras going on. Don't even know which one I'm at. Okay. So right now, there are two topics that are doing really, really well in this day and age. And here are just some of them. So we have any everything from make a website. So people are coming online and they, they. Uh, so they want to start their own online business. Same with online business. That's the red the red graph here. Uh, make a website. Pretty steady here. Let's see. Let's see uh, dog training. Dog, everyone's getting dogs nowadays, so they have to now train the dog. You have working from home. Starting a home farm. Check that out. Home farm. Gardening. Huge. Because people are freaking out right now. They're like, oh, what's going to happen? Am I going to starve to death? Oh, what am I going to do? Well, this is not, this, this is, a, these are hobbies that people are picking these hobbies up. If they find that they're going to be interested in these types of things, 
they're probably going to continue this you know, later down the line. Now, granted, some of it might die out, but what you're seeing here is the start of habits being created. So some of those other habits include investing, gardening, some other ones off the top of my head, a lot of the ClickBank Marketplace uh, offers, like for example, we got the dog training, just talked about that. Let me pull this back a little bit to give you guys some rough ideas of what's doing really well. We have things like a lot of health offers doing well, like home remedies doing well, diabetes. I don't really like working in that niche as an affiliate. It's kind of, it's one of those topics I like to stay away from. You got woodworking, hobbies, all these things are doing really, really well. So there's a lot of opportunity out there right now if you're willing to capture it and you have the will to do it. So let me get a one in the chat box if you agree with that. If you have the will to achieve good things, even in bad times, this is what turns things around. This is what allows people to get better instead of smaller. If you have the will and the desire to build the good life, you can achieve it no matter what. I'm living proof of that. I'll show you in a little bit a screenshot of when I, it was 2008, 2009 or so. That was one of my best years. Because people were giving up, I was pushing forward. All right, got a lot of ones, got a lot of ones there. Okay, good. So let's start jumping in. What what can you specifically do to capitalize in this? Now, I just want to, I am going to be focusing in this training on kind of the online business, start a website space. Now, there are so many different spaces that you can use right now. Doing well, I talked about those. Like, here's the dog training product. 174 Gravity on ClickBank right now, $30 sale. Here's another one, $73 a sale. That's actually pretty good money because when you're talking sales, getting those numbers down, all you're looking at is two, three, or even one or two sales, and you're at uh, $3,000 a month or more. So it's really easy when you think of it like that, right? Like you don't need 10,000 sales a day, just one or two at the right price point, and you can see really good results. Okay, so let me, I'm going to shut off this main ca that camera's too. I can see it lagging right now. So with that said, let's jump in here. We have the $73 a sale. Now, the good thing about certain topics is you can stack them up. Now, if you remember in my, if you saw my previous email, we talked about stacking offers. And this is something I go in pretty big with. Okay, we got here. Okay, this is something I go in pretty big in the program. And that is really stacking up things, uh, stacking up offers so it makes sense sequentially. So this is how you go from say, and we're going to dive into this in just in a mo a mi just a moment. But let's just say, for example, step one, you got your $50 offer, which is a little on the low side, but that's still okay. You can still make plenty of money from that. And so that's sale number one. Let's say sale number two, you get a good, usually I like to aim for about $100 sale there on sale number two. And this can really start to add up. So just by getting one customer through the proper type of funnel, whether it be if you're as an affiliate, there's different ways to go about it. I'll show you later. But uh, this is how you really stack those commissions. You go from just making a measly $50 to $250. Do you see why that makes such a difference? You know, talking, I talked about this in some of my other training classes, but I know it's really easy to get stuck up in like, oh, Amazon, you know, Amazon is going to be uh, easy to make sales. But it's a, it changes things when you're talking $250 in commissions or more. Now I said funnels there. I don't really mean funnels because you can do this with a blog. This is what I recommend that you do. We do most of this with blogging, email follow-ups and all of that. So this can be done without having to create videos. If you don't want to, I'm I've, of course, like I'm the, I'm the YouTube guy. So I like doing YouTube videos, but you don't have to. Okay. So let me know if you're following along. Let me just get a one. Let me get a yes in the chat box if you're following along with me and make sure. And also if everything's okay, audio is good, if video is good, and, and then we'll just move forward in just a second. Okay. So with that said, let's take a look at some offers and how this kind of fits in. So I'm a big, uh, one of my favorite markets, this is the one I spend a good portion of my time in, is basically, as you know, the, the start an online business, the affiliate marketing, create a website space. These are my favorite, favorite niches to go after. Now, I've made plenty of money in, I'd say, probably a dozen to 20 different affiliate uh, markets out there. So I have, I'm pretty well versed. But there are certain topics that really do it for you and the ones that do it for me, right? Like there's... I remember this one, let me just uh, digress a little bit here. I remember this one affiliate site that I had. I really hated this topic. Now I made 10 to $11,000 a month, but I could not stand creating another, a single, I'm like, if I gotta make another one of these videos, I'm just gonna go jump off a bridge. Well, uh, the good news is that if, you, if you're passionate about a topic, like I am for online business or markets where there's a lot of things that you can sell, you can make a small fortune in a very short amount of time. So let's go, let's go. So what are those offers? 
right? Like you might be asking, what are those things? Well, you want to go after the big niches like money, investing, also a lot of health topics. Like let's just take a home workout plan, for example. There are literally 30 to 40 different products that you could sell that person. So in this example and in my stay home commission program, we do focus more on online business and online income opportunities because if you saw in the previous reports here, a lot of people are going to be getting used to work from home. So these are some of the best topics to go after. Okay. So it, and just a, a side note, if you don't want to do online business or if you don't want to do online income in the program, we also cover all kinds of different hobbies, different uh, types of things like gardening, all these different things that people are interested in right now. Now, if you're wondering, you know, oh, do I have to be an expert to make money in these topics? The answer is no. There are ways that you can get other people to do this for you for cheap, even for free. You'd be surprised what you can get people to do for free, especially if you start networking a little bit. That's a little bit more advanced, but you can pay people very cheaply, experts, to really carve out that kind of authority that you're looking for. We cover this a lot in my program. So let's take a look at some offers. Imagine that the person is interested in creating a online business. Well, what are those things that that person's going to need? They're going to need to have a website. So let's just, I, I randomly picked a hosting company here at Bluehost. It's like 65 bucks a sale. That's about in the range that I'm looking for. Here's another one, uh, WP Engine. $200 a sale, okay? $200 a sale, we're talking the big bucks. Can you see how making that type of money can make such a difference? Not only like for your online business, but really for your life, right? I mean, imagine if you have two, $300 coming in a day. That's a big difference, isn't it? Here's another type of product. If they have a website, they're also gonna need themes. So here is a customer may need a theme of some sort. We're looking 35% commissions, 100 bucks, so it's 35 bucks. Here's another $4,500. These are easy sales because as I mentioned in the in the step process with the little man, where is it? We're right, not there. This guy right here. I hope you can see that. Let me just verify that you can actually see that. Yeah, you should be able to see that. Okay, so uh, boom, website. Get the website. Okay, number two, they're going to need, here's a, let's just say website, 50 to $200. Theme, boom, 200 bucks, 100 bucks, whatever. This is just for the sake of doing it. Another thing you might need is like a coach or something. Someone to help them do it or like a video marketing product or like an email service. Like, for example, uh, give response. That's who I use. Let me just pull these up right now. Uh, let's see. You guys are kind of getting a behind the scenes look at the magician right now. So uh, this is, uh, you know, like you ever watch a magic trick and you see like, oh, God, that's so awesome. And you figure out you figure out like how it's done. It's not so cool anymore. Well, in this situation, you're going to be losing the magic, the fun of that magic. But you're going to make a whole bunch of money instead. Isn't that a good trade-off? Okay, so $100 there for get, for get response. So these things add up. Now, one of the things that people have trouble with is they start thinking you need tens of thousands of visitors to make a lot of money. That's not the case. The case is you need to figure out who it is that you are talking to, who you are marketing to. So do you get what I mean by that? This is a very abstract con concept. This made all the difference for me once I was able to determine that there's a different type of customer. Okay, so I'm, I call this the tale, the tale of three bobs. Okay, we're gonna flip over my little PowerPoint presentation here to give you an idea of what I'm talking about. And there and there. Okay, so I call it the tale of three bobs. So Bob number one, that's Bob right there. All right, Bob number one, he's like not so happy of a guy. He's kind of hates life. He's miserable. He's he spends half his time on the internet, really getting nothing accomplished. Bob number two is he's pretty cool, man. He's all right. Bob number two, he's kind of fun to hang out with, but you know, you don't really know too much about him. Bob number three though, Bob number three is the best Bob. He's cool because he's just fun. He has a lot of cool tricks that he can do. Um, he also has, uh, okay, that's a, little, that's a little inappropriate. Let me cut that off. <laughs> okay, so Bob number three is the, the, the type of customer you want to spend your money on, spend your time on. So Bob number three is what's called a hot audience. And this is something I cover very in-depth in, inside of my stay home commission program. But in essence, when you have someone who really knows what they want, and there are different types of traffic sources you can go to to get these types of people, but a hot person, someone who's a hot uh, 
a hot customer or hot someone in, hot, highly interested in the topic is one of the easiest sales that you could ever make. So I like to spend, for beginners, I recommend you go after hot audiences. So there are various ways you can go about this with, with SEO, something I have to cover a lot in stay-at-home commissions. Uh, certain websites, certain topics, certain, uh, certain angles that you can hit from lets you pull out the hot audience out of the member. So in other words, the hot people are the ones that spend money. Now there's another tier in this, and this is kind of like the warm tier customer. Okay. Still a great customer to go after. There are, let's say, let's just really simplify this. Let's say out of every 10 people, you got like one, uh, one like super, uh, so I just realized that I'm talking ridiculous stuff here. Okay. You got one, one customer who's like really into it. Let's say you got about two that are kind of like, eh, but I'm still interested in it. So it'll be a little bit more challenging to sell the angle that you approach with a warm topic, a warm customer. Let me just make this official here on my whiteboard. Warm. The, the way you approach a warm viewer or a warm customer is a lot different than you would to approach someone who really is enthusiastic. Now on the other side of the scale, oh, I just realized that you guys are not seeing me. My apologies. Uh, yeah. Okay. I hope you guys saw the Bob, the Bob, the Bob gimmick that I run. Okay. Um, so number three is the cold audience. So the cold audience is like someone just chilling on the internet. They probably don't even realize that they're interested in this topic, but then something clicks. So have you ever seen a like Facebook ad or something you're totally not interested in? And then for whatever reason, the topic really caught your, your attention. And then after a series of emails or a series of seeing different ads, you're finally like, you know what, let's check this out. Let's see if I can like buy this product here. And if, uh, if it's something I'd be interested in, has, has there ever been a time where you've like just randomly saw this topic and you wanted to buy something? Well, that person was probably, uh, it was a blog or YouTube video or whatever it is. They were advertising to you kind of coldly. So they don't, you don't know them. You, they don't, you don't really know you even like the topic, but something clicked and it made you want the product. So this is about seven out of, out of 10 people are in this cold audience. So the reason why people have trouble, especially if you're new, if, if you've never made sales online before in your life is because you're probably focused on doing the cold audience and not really realizing it. So there are different tiers and in the program, I really show you how to hammer that out. Each approach is not wrong. It's just that each approach, uh, each cold, warm, hot needs its own different approach. It needs its own follow-up sequences. It needs its own different types of products. And that's kind of your goal. This is how you turn kind of small amounts of, of, of viewers into a large amount of profits. So let me say, let me get a, uh, let me get a, I agree in the chat box if, or maybe this give me a yes in the chat box if this makes sense to you and to let me know that you can actually see what I'm saying because I'm convinced that no one can see what I'm saying. Corey Steiner says crap in the middle, but I had a $900 affiliate sale last week. Yeah, that's, that's incredible, Corey, like that. Yeah, nine hundred. The, 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 when you get a $900 sale and it's like, boom, whoo, the day just went from crappy to bad. All right, I mean, crappy to great. All right. Okay, guys. So let me know if you have any questions in that regard. And just to give you some brief, a, a brief, let's keep, actually, you know what? I want to add another little, another little tip here. So this hot audience right here, let's, let's like flip this over to this page here. So you got your hot customer in here is Bob. He like really likes the topic. Um, I don't know what these things are, but there's Bob hanging out. He really likes this topic. So Bob probably, let's just say, if you want to talk in the terms of dog training, but Bob just got a new dog. He, you know, the dog is peeing all over the rug. So let's say his problem is the dog is peeing all over the rug. Well, you know that about uh, Bob, he has a new dog. The dog is peeing over the rug. So that means that that first product that you promote to him, if he's a hot, if it's highly targeted, so it would be a, a training course on, you know, how to keep your dog, your new dog from peeing on the floor that uh, it's going to be the easiest sale that you can make. It just, this is what he already wants. So you're not going to have to spend like 500 days, 400 days following up to get Bob to, oh man, you guys don't see me again. Okay, there we go. All right, let me re, re, redo this again. So we take Bob over to this. This is hot, Bob's a hot customer. We spend over there. This is Bob right here. Okay, Bob. Okay, so he, his dog is peeing everywhere and he's trying to get those sales. So the easiest sale again is going to be a course on how to do it, how to stop him from doing it. Another product, this is just going with the example here. The medium range might be like something like P, you know, dog pee remover. So that is that P? What is that? Like that? I don't know, whatever, P. And then another one could be like a you know, in-person dog training class. In-person dog training, whatever. 
Okay, so does that make sense to you guys? If so, give me a yes in the chat box if you if you follow along with me. If that if that makes a lot of sense. Okay, so with that said, uh, if you have any questions for me, hold those for just a minute. And I'm, I'm going to make this a very short kind of brief about stay home commissions because I know I promised you it was 95% content and 5% mention of the program. So in the program, we cover a lot of, where are we over here? Okay, we're over here. So in the program, we, co we cover a lot of these very minute details. This is the difference between you, like just getting, it took me a while to figure this out. Like for the longest time, let me tell you a quick story. The longest time as an affiliate, one of my first affiliate sites, it, it, it got traffic, but I could not figure out how to get it to convert. Have you ever sent, if you're more intermediate or say beginner to intermediate, have you ever sent a lot of clicks to an offer and then all, and it just wouldn't convert, right? Like, isn't that frustrating? You, you made the site, you're getting traffic, you sent hundreds of clicks to the offer and it just doesn't convert into sales. Well, the reason why is because of those different targeting that I just talked about. So we, I really ha hammer this in in the course because it doesn't in the program because it does not matter at all how much traffic you get if you can't convert it into sales. So that's one of the things we really dive into in the program. So let me go briefly go over to uh, over you what's involved because I don't want to make this like a big long thing. So just real quick, I'm going to zing through it. We have the Stay Home Commission program. This releases tomorrow. And let me just point something out to you real quick. Check out this bad boy right here. 2020 recent is as can be. So we're talking big bucks in this. All right. So this is not like some, you know, little hoopla kind of like piddly paddle here. We're talking piddly paddle. We're talking like serious, serious money. So basically uh, it's an, a, a, a six week program. Uh, from basement to rooftop, how to create an easy, fun, and addictive online business that makes earning commissions to you basically as natural to you as breathing. So week number one, we'll get all the markets, uh, the money markets that always win. So you'll learn how to profit from wildly profitable, uh, popular online income space and about 100 other markets if you don't want to do that topic. There is no limit to what you can achieve. We'll also do have, uh, you how, figure out how to use trends to uncover blue oceans. We'll talk about how to uncover the best products, how to see what it is, looking through my eyes, what the good programs are. The 3X stack, this is exactly, we just briefly mentioned this in the program, this is exactly how you do that. So you'll walk away with complete certainty on the market you should go after. Now, week number two, kryptonite keywords. So these are all the things that the, the, the keywords that you can go in, whether it be search engine optimization, YouTube, blog posts, other sites like Medium that I like, Pinterest. This is how you kind of hack the search engines in, in, a, in a legitimate way. So there's a whole bunch of stuff, all different kind of keywords and strategies that would go against that. Now, I know keywords, everyone's like, oh, keywords. Keywords are where the money's at. So you got to learn how to do that. Week number three, I call these underachiever affiliate assets. So I'm going to show you how to quick you look, create one of the under most underrated digital assets on the internet that can create these lack the sex appeal. Don't get these ain't sexy. They ain't like Facebook ads where it's all like, oh, got to get the Facebook ads. It's not sexy, but it makes a lot of money. So isn't that important? It's, and more importantly, you don't have to spend a dime doing it. So number, week number four, email cash flow. So this is money cash flow that indoors. Okay, we're talking in the literally 12 years or more people open up my emails literally from 12 years ago they still open those up today bonus stacks i'll show you how to create simple little bonus programs to really triple double triple your conversion rates how to automate everything weed number five buyers that just cannot be stopped okay so you're going to see exactly how to create content very easily that kind of cir circumvents the kind of you know, trial period that's typically required to get your content ranked. I'll show you to copy and paste it to, to take, turn that content into valuable images, slides, videos, infographics, and more for a 100% risk-free business. Week number six, another you. So wouldn't it be great if you ever said to yourself, right? Like, oh, I really wish I had like another one of me. Well, that is exactly how you do it. Now it is backed up by my 100 money back. I call it the 100 money back guarantee. So this is my most unusual 100 day money back guarantee. Plus, I'm gonna give you a $100 bonus money back in addition to that. So the program, uh, so this would cover 100 days and $100 uh, on top of that. Okay, guys, so that's essentially the the program we release tomorrow at 9am. If you have any additional questions for me, just let me know what those questions are. And if you want more training, just let me know what that what, you, what it is that you want me to talk about. So this is kind of open forum right now. We'll, I'll go into additional training if you'd like, but I'm happy to talk about anything. So again, Stay Home Commissions releases tomorrow. Oh, the best part, the best part. Forgot to mention this bad boy right here. Bam! You get yourself a nice 
New, matter of fact, let me get that. Uh, this is the only this pay. This is the only way you can get this cup. Bam! Part that's one. This bonus number one for that. Okay, so that is uh, going to be it for the training. Uh, the the uh, what, what I want to talk about in so far. But if you have any different specific topics that you want to t t to talk about, whoa! Why is there a box on my face? Wait a minute, what's going on here? Let me, uh, give me one sec, let me adjust my camera. This is ridiculous. Okay. Let me stick with that. All right, so if you have any questions for me, let me know, this camera looks like crap. Okay, so what are the traffic sources? We do a lot of SEO, a lot of mostly all free traffic. We're talking Medium, Pinterest. Those are a lot of things I like to go after. Your own content on your own, uh, uh, your own digital assets. All of these things are great to go after. <clears throat> Chris says, I recently started to learn guitar website and blog, struggling to get consistent traffic and conversions. Would this help with that? Absolutely. How do you? How do we have to? How long do we have to come up with the? capital for the program. Um, I'm, I'm not, I'm not going to, I don't believe I'm going to be ra raising the prices in like a day, but it just depends on how many people come in because of the nature of it, I can't really support too many people because it's kind of, it's kind of more hands-on and I have a lot of other kind of things in the back end that I need to take care of. So I'm not going to, I don't want to put any, you know, scarcity on this. I cannot promise you anything though. So, um, as long as, long as it's as long as it's going most likely in my head right now i'm going to uh once things start to kind of settle down here we we'll talk as far as like the corona and all that once that kind of settles down i'm probably going to put it at the normal rate uh giovanni says this one-on-one -on -one training um no it's a live the live class there'll be live classes if you can't if you can't attend those you'll get the recording and in the facebook group that i'm going to talk about tomorrow We'll also do a bunch of little live uh, group coaching sessions there. Let's not talk about the program. I don't want to talk about the program. Is there any 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 topics that you want to, uh, would that, any topics you want to talk about, specifically about as far as like marketing or anything of that nature? Well, this is crooked because I got to get more content out here for you guys. Um, Mike says we up re -up upload this webinar to YouTube. Mike, it'll be as soon as this gets off, it should actually compile right away and be posted up there. Okay, here's a good question. John Chambers says, Dan, I have a great problem with WordPress. Most themes on WordPress are splattered full of pictures. Can you recommend a decent theme? So I do have, I do have a, 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 a managed WordPress service I've been working on where we have themes made specifically for affiliate marketers. Uh, behind stay home commissions, once you get in, you can get info on that. A lot of the, a lot of the themes I like nowadays are white space themes are, are very content focused themes that are put a lot of con uh, focus on the writing. So I know a lot of people don't like me using, doing videos. So, uh, the, most of the programs focus on the writing, but writing is a great way still to make a lot of money. Let's think about how, how much money I've made off my writing over the last, I don't know. <clears throat> 20 years at now uh, is still a very, very powerful way to make money. So, and even if you do videos, writing is still involved. I don't know where I, I got a little bit on the tangent on there. Okay. Uh, MRG says, what's the best way to get free traffic that works? There are, there's a million and one ways. Uh, first of all, my strip, my recommendation to you is to stop jumping around from traffic source to traffic source. So I did that for a while and don't get me wrong. You can make that work. But the things I like to focus on are SEO, so search engine optimization, really understanding how to do that and getting and also using your articles and your blog posts and your other content to encourage people to share and to opt into your email list. Now, an email list is a great source of traffic, but you're going to need other things to funnel into that email list. So this is something we talk about in the program, but essentially, uh, let's say you just go with Pinterest and Medium, right? So you, you tack those two traffic sources. When they go to your blog, this is how you get, this is you funnel from your blog into your email list. So once you have the people on your email list, you can then take that and send it back into your blog. Or if you want to start a, uh, you know, a YouTube channel or Facebook page or whatever it is, you can take that funnel, that traffic on demand and send it back for free. Okay. So that's that. Uh, Giovanni says blogging takes a while to get traffic. Yes, but not as long as you think. 
not as long as you think, especially when you understand the keywords. Um, it's not, we're not talking three, three, four years. You can do this in a month or two months. If you really want to speed it up, you can work in other traffic sources. Just go where people are already going. So um, that's that. And, uh, and Amin says, are you going to update the Deadbeat Super Affiliate system? Uh, Stay Home Commissions is essentially Deadbeat Super Affiliate 2.0. So at some point, once this, uh, you know, the Corona thing is over and it doesn't make sense to call it Sam commissions, I'm just going to take it and re kind of rebrand it as deadbeat super affiliate Two. And of course, when I do that, you will have the same program. Okay. What are your main sources of articles? Freelance, iWriter, Spinner. Um, so this is Tim, uh, Tim, Man Tim Manassi. Good question, Tim. Um, I actually depends on the topic. But I like Upwork. I've had, I have a, a lot of scripts. I've gone through a lot of people to understand how to get good writers. So there are, you get a little bit of a uh, kind of like a skill to pick out who's the good person, who's going to be reliable. Once you crack that, it's so easy to get good writers, especially with experts. I have a whole strategy for getting like actual experts from Upwork to like give me, do the writing for me in a way that's legitimate for me to like use their, their like results. So it'll be like, for example, I'll say, hey, if you're good at this topic and you have results, Will you write an article for me? We'll use your name. We'll just post it on my my site under your name, and you can talk about your experience that way. Okay, so that's the that's the answer to that question. Uh, Rob saying when's this? Uh, Rob is saying how do we buy it? Uh, so the, I'm releasing it tomorrow at 9 a.m. I just want to come on to answer some quick questions. Uh, I want to focus. Uh, so you'll get a link in email. I want to focus on actual training though in this video, just because I said in the email that'd be 95% training. So let's see if you guys have any questions for me. Let's see if we can talk about uh, some of that stuff. Okay, so let's see here. Someone's asking, say, uh, now open for lunch. Low quality webcam videos are better than no videos, right? Uh, absolutely. I mean, here, here's the thing. There, I do this all the time. Matter of fact, it's, it's story time. It is story time. So every once in a while, I'll get it in a rut and um, I will look, I'll still be doing a lot of work in the back end, but up front, like for example, videos, I'm sitting there and I'm just like, oh God, I don't make a video today. And then like, I, I kind of procrastinate. I procrastinate in the sense that my, the way I procrastinate is I say, well, you know what I'm going to do is I'm going to just make this the best video that I've ever made. It's going to be funny. It's going to be scripted. It's going to be the best thing out there. Really that perfectionism is just a form of procrastination. So no video, like look at this video, the video I'm on right now, this looks like crap. Unfortunately, my good camera shut off. I had a Canon 70D was like lagging. So I'm on this like old five-year-old Logitech video thing, but does it really make a difference? I mean, yeah, I mean, it looks like hell, but it, it still works, right? I mean, it, it's not the best, but it's a video. It's a video. Okay. Um, Giovanni says, is there any paid advertising techniques? Giovanni, yes, we will cover that in one of the weeks. The bonus week, probably. <clears throat> okay. Any additional questions you guys have for me? Nathan Earl says, Dan, hope you're doing well. Good to see you here. You on here. Thanks, Nathan. I'm getting back into the swing of things. Um, you guys wondering where I've, uh, where I've been. I've been behind the scenes working on like building the actual business. So sometimes I just need to, <clears throat> excuse me, sometimes you just need to like step back and get out of the spotlight because being in the spotlight is very hard to focus on. Like when you're up front, it's very hard to focus on the stuff in the back. So I just said, all right, I need a break from that. And I took a vacation like six months ago. I don't know if you guys saw that. Uh, but yeah, Mary Maria says, you look great. Ah, thank you. <laughs> okay. Okay, Chris Ger Chris Gurr says, can you talk a lot about backlinks? Why and how? So, Chris, actually, I've, I spend a lot of focus, more focus now on getting the backlinks made for me from people that want, do my articles. Another another way to go, uh, and what I mean by that is, I re create really good content, and I, I've learned to uh, strategically put share share points in there so people share it through social media and just kind of gets the whole thing going. But in addition to that, you have a lot of strategies that you can do to uncover some of those backlinks that uh, your competitors have. So what I usually do is I look at my competitors and I go through line by line. I look at their backlinks. I look at how, how many links are coming off those backlinks. And I try to determine, can I get that link also? Now you'd be surprised. Some people have like, if you're, if you're an authority in the space, you're going to build up links that are going to be harder to, uh, get them like you, that you can't really you know, trick so to speak you'll get those naturally but if you look at your competitors and i have strategies for this in stay home commissions um this is one of the best way to get backlinks because you can look at it and see exactly where they get theirs and just replicate it 
So that's one of the ways. And I know that was very kind of not direct. There's just a good bit to it. It's easy once you figure it out, of course, but um, it's kind of hard. It's, there's too much to talk about right here. Okay. Um, hack and slash as I purchased damn products before. They were all amazing. Thank you, hack and slash. Uh, Amin says, what is my favorite autoresponder tool? Do I have any approach to your email list segmentation and cleansing? Yeah, that's a good question. So, uh, Amin, Amin, I don't know if I pronounce your name right. It's, it's a weird name. Um, <laughs> yeah, it's a weird name. Amin, it almost looks like anime to me. So, get response is great. I like it. I also will clean emails from people that don't open. If I've sent out emails consecutively and people don't open my emails after a year, I delete those people because it bogs down your open rate a good bit. Um, I segment people based off when they buy from me. So, or if they come in through a certain funnel for, from the affiliate, uh, the, a certain page from the affiliate side of things, I'll segment them that way. So I want to always have a, a, a list segmented out to determine what it is that I want that customer to do. Uh, Joseph says, can you recommend a program or product for a total newbie? Uh, Joseph, of course, I'm going to be biased. I'm going to recommend that you pick up stay home commissions and I will send out the link tomorrow. It opens up 9 a.m. And it's pretty much everything you need to do, to do from basement to rooftop to create an online business that's both fun, exciting, and dare I say, addictive. Okay, Corey, how's it going, man? I see you. Uh, Authentic Tune says, would you still recommend Deadbeat Super Affiliate System? So this is the new, the Stay Home Commissions is essentially the new the new version. I'm going to, I called it that for, I don't know why I decided to call it Stay Home Commissions. I did. Uh, but we're going to take basically just to kind of have it fit in with the, you know, current, current times going on. Uh, once this is over, I'm going to just take it, swap out the little intros and, and exits or whatever, and rename it Deadbeat Super Affiliate 2. I think um, you'll still get it. So when you invest tomorrow, you're, you get the same exact thing. So when I move it over, you get moved over, nothing changes for you. Joseph says he's going to be waiting. Good. That's good to hear. You're going to enjoy the program. It is mm, spectacular. Uh, nope. But thank you for offering this Dan product. Host. Nope. For lunch. Thank you for the comments. Um, <clears throat> excuse me. When do you think co coronavirus will be finished? Um, I, I, uh, well, look, I've not had the best track record in the t into, uh, you know, figuring out when the best time it, it, when that'll happen. Um, I, th I think the doctors and all the experts are saying it's going to last for quite a while. Um, it's going to, it's going to probably go on for like a year or two or indefinitely maybe. Uh, what do you, what do you guys think about that? Comment below if so. B Boom blogger says why you will not buy new cloth for yourself. Well, I actually have seven robes if I could get to them. Matter of fact, I take that as a challenge. All right. This is just, oh, oh, ow. there's a couple of my many robes bam what you think about that got three more over there in the corner talking about i need new to i gotta need new clothes oh okay man got toilet paper everywhere Whoa. okay call it the deadbeat show <laughs> okay andrew says dan i'm tired of being broke please help me well andrew the first thing i'd say is you got to help yourself no one's no one's there is no there is no uh Unfortunately, there is no kind of magic, you know, helping hand that's going to come down. You might get a few scraps here and there. But the only way to get, to get on broke is to kind of take control, uh, activate that hunter mind. It's like I, I call it like the hunter mind where you just like start seeing things for yourself. You think for yourself. That's really the first step. So if you're not there yet, that's the good, good to uh, good. To, that's a good step here. Let's see here. Nathan's, uh, uh, Corey Klein says, good to see you. I make sure that you get some love in King Humans Facebook group. Thank you. <laughs> yeah, I like, I like Dave. He's great. King Human. He's a, he's a character. <clears throat> uh, Mike says, Dan, will you still keep the current Deadbeat Super Affiliate going? looks like a lot of gold in the program. There's still a lot of gold. Yeah, it's still available. Uh, Mike, I mean, it's still, you can still access it. I believe the link is. Yeah, you, uh, I, I close the doors for any any new uh, in purchases on it because this is the new version, uh, stay home commissions. But it's deadbeat.com slash portal, I believe, is the link to log in. 
Okay. Now open for lunch is now time to take action there. The socks are where it's at. I'm I'm working on a sock line for my merch store. I now have a merch store. Um, it's for only kind of it's for only deadbeats that have invested in my products. Uh, I don't think I'm going to make it public, but uh, a merch store. I got some merch coming. Like for example, that cup. If only you saw that. Boom. I'm so happy about this cup. Got the deadbeat on the front, and got the the deadbeat. Uh, I don't know if you can see that. It's a little blurry. That's the deadbeat slogan on the back. I got pillows. I got T-shirts. I'm I'm working on the robe and I'm working on the socks. Nathan Earl says, "Hey, if you're broke, seriously pick a service you want to be good at and study YouTube videos like crazy, then find some clients for the service. I did that years ago and make good money sense. It's awesome, Nathan." Okay. Excuse me. Uh, so yeah, let me, let me let's talk about that actually. I I like to I always like to do the I always like to to provide kind of this in, insight on the mindset. So at some point, I'll just tell you when it was for me. Like when I was like six or seven years old, I've told this story before, but I think it's kind of crucial. When I was like six or seven, I was sitting in school and there was all the kids would be like, oh, yeah, when I get rich, I'm going to buy this Lamborghini. I'm going to get a Ferrari. I'm going to get a Porsche. This is like something like, you know, young kids were to do. Right. So there I was. And I'm like, I look around, I look out the windows. Like, I've never seen a Porsche. I've never seen a Lamborghini in my life. Never seen a Ferrari in my life. So it was like I got 30 kids here saying they're going to get Porsches and Ferraris. Not a single one of their parents have it. So clearly the way to, to not get a Porsche is to get a job and to uh, work for somebody. Cause I just saw all of their parents work for somebody, no Porsche, no Ferrari, no Lamborghini. Now I found as I age Porsche and Lamborghini and Ferrari is just, a, it's a fool's errand. It's a fool's errand. It's to make you think you, Oh, look at me. I'm, I'm all important with my Lamborghini. And you think, you know, oh, I get to show I'm successful. I'll attract mates this way. It's all kind of an illusion. But if you want to go for the Porsche and all that, you go for the Ferrari and all that. I've already had two Porsches, and to me, they're a waste of a waste of time and money. But where I'm going with this is that at that moment, I was like, okay, it's time to activate the the thought, my own, to self actualize. I think is the best way to put it to become aware of how things are in the world. So you start really thinking for yourself at that moment when you realize no one's really going to give you what it is that you want. So. Don't, and you, and the other just the other decision I made is like you can't bully you can't really bully your way to it. Um, some people do, but the 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 best way to go about it is to think your way to the things that you want. So it all starts with that thought, that thought that you're on your own and that it's up to you to to create the things that you want in your life. And I know I feel like this is so cliche and inside my head it's a lot more complex than the way I just said it. But once you activate that hunter mind. That's the first step. And then from there, you have to start learning the strategies. So you say to yourself, what do I want in life? Do I want you know, a house in San Diego overlooking the beach, a $3 million house with all that? Well, that's the end point. So you have to start working back from there. What are the steps for me to go from that to that? You have to start using that hunter mind. Okay. Now, obviously, you need tactics and strategies and products to sell to, is the way to go. I believe the best way to do that is with an online business. That's always been my go-to. That's what I did. Now, people do it other ways, basketball, football, whatever it is. They're not doing too well right now, though. Okay. Uh, Amin says, will the new course cover SEO? Yes, we go a lot into SEO. SEO and email marketing. Uh, pseudo acronyms for basically make a bunch of money. Okay. So if you don't know what SEO is or email marketing, let me just say the simple, simplistic way. It is like the fast track to making earning affiliate commissions in a way that's natural to you as walking or breathing. Okay, anyone having it? Uh, what do I think about Think and Grow Rich? Um, you know, I'm gonna be honest uh, about reading books in general. I, I've read a bunch of books and um, I find some benefit in them, but I would go as far as to say that like you're. There's stuff you can learn in books, but you'll learn a lot better in the trenches, kind of figuring stuff out, out on your own. That's just my opinion. Ty Lopez might say differently, but in the business game, I believe that your best teacher is, that doesn't mean don't learn from people. Let me just clarify that. Uh, the best way to learn in this business is hanging around other people 
and, and being involved with the, the industry in general. Like there's, I have some friends who are so good at this business. There's been a couple sentences they say to me like that once I pay, let me give you an example. Just recently I went to like a $3,000 mastermind. It was $3,000. And there was one thing that I picked out from there. It was, there was thousands of things that they taught. I kind of got bored and zoned out, but there was one thing on there that made it just, I was like, God, that's brilliant. Okay. I'm going to use that for now on. So I took that one thing. In fact, if you guys remind me inside of stay home commissions, I will actually reveal that one thing that I learned that it's like, wow, that is going to increase my money by 10 to 20% from this point forward. One sentence. So um, you get better, you get, you're going to learn better from people and the books are and the books don't really transmute, transmit the kind of information the right way. It, there's like a, a disconnect there. So you have to kind of like decipher it and then take it in and then like, translate it back into kind of action. There's a, there's a a gap there, but if you learn from other people through programs, in person, Facebook groups, how's audio, how's the audio going guys? Test one, two, got some people talking about that. Okay. Chris says, I think it's a good way to procrastinate. I agree. Okay. So, uh, we're going for about 45 minutes. Let's just do about five more minutes of Q and a, let's talk about some things that uh, you guys want me to talk anything to do with marketing and I will be getting more on some live streams over the upcoming days. I kind of lost my video mojo there for a little bit, but I'm getting back into the YouTube game. Okay. So anyone have any additional questions here and we will, uh, keep going. Uh, we'll, sh we'll shut it off. Okay. All is good. All is good. Musik says, do you hunt expired domains for your SEO? Uh, yes, we, I teach that in the program uh, a decent amount if you want to learn how to do that. Okay, so Tim, Tim on is saying, launching a specialized supplement e-commerce store for muscle guys and gals. What would the Deadbeat affiliate do to launch for SEO with 30 keywords that have about 40,000 a month, a month in search volume? Well, what I would do is, um, this is a strategy I've been working on a lot. I've been focusing a lot on question words. Uh, this is one of the most powerful ways to get traffic pretty damn easily. So I, I always recommend starting from question, question words now because those are a little easier to rank for because you know exactly what that person wants. So it's so easy to tell and it's they're easier to make sales from because you know exactly what's going on in their mind. So um, that's the answer to that. John says, how can we make a video without being on camera? Hire someone from Viver. John, if you want to know how to do that, check out my Tube Tycoon program. Uh, check out Tube Tycoon. I believe it's tubetycoon.com slash yes, if I'm not mistaken. That's, a, that is, that's basically what that program is about. So the new program is not so much with video. I do have, I will have a module, uh, uh, maybe one of the weeks I'll devote to you, YouTube, maybe like a half of a week, or whatever. But um, it's not going to be the main focus. Mostly we're focusing on other types of content, blogs, emails, graphics, slide shares, videos that you don't really have to be in. That's what will be a little bit of videos. Okay. All right, guys. So with that, with that said, um, Amin says, I have two websites I've made in 2017 based on the Deadbeat Super Affiliate System, each earning passively a couple hundred bucks. It's awesome. They were hit hard in the latest update. Yeah, so, um, yeah, Amin, so you're going to want the new program. So it's updated, offered, it's what you need to do to get those back online. Nathan says, I'm in Tube Time Nakoon. It's great. Someone says, am I sweating in my pajamas? Yeah, like, look, it's like, oh, it's going nuts. Okay, DJ Ray says can't wait till tomorrow. That's awesome, DJ. Uh, it's a very good program. It's one. Of, it's my best one so far. That's why it took so long. You guys remember like, like a month and a half ago. I'm like, hey, it's gonna be ready soon. I'm like, man. Basically, my basically that my original thought for the program was I was just gonna make it a quick kind of little two day course. You know, two two day little like live training event. But I really got into it. I was like, whoa, this is like really fun. This is like one. Of, I wanted this to be one of my best things. So. It's I've, I've turned it from that, that idea. It's like a freaking 
six week program, exactly what you need to do to earn. Like I'm talking serious money, not just like play money here. I mean, that's in the bonus week alone. I don't know if you can see that. I mean, this ain't joke money. Okay. So that will release tomorrow at 9 a.m. Keep an eye out for your email, uh, your email inbox. I will send you that link around 9 a.m. David Smith says, I like Yavo a lot so far. Thanks, David. Like, uh, let me know if you need anything. We have your site. We have your site done, by the way. Uh, it's a little rough draft, the rough draft phase. It should be uh, the rough draft right now. Um, I'll update you in a second in, after I get off this or like or tomorrow or something. Um, David says, how do I feel about adult niches? Um, if that's what you want to do, um, go for it. I mean, there, there is, um, there, there is, you, you know, there's a lot of money to be made there. I don't like those personally, just because it's not really like for me. I'm a wholesome guy. I'm a wholesome guy. Uh, someone says, why is the price so low? I agree. Uh, 697 is, uh, way lower than I, I was going to do it, but I figure, I mean, people, people are kind of like stuck at home, maybe, you know, not everyone's able to pull it off. So for now, uh, I, I'm keeping it low at 697. And of course, 10% will be do donated to the startup fund, startup, startup relief fund. This is actually st all global businesses. So um, that's that, 9 a.m. EST. Premier Marketing says Deadbeat provides amazing info. Thank you. Appreciate you. Excuse me. All right, any final questions here? And I will we'll get off and get me some sleep. John Chambers, thanks for coming on. 9 a.m. EST, yep, Richard, 90, or EDT, I believe. 9 a.m. EDT. Mike, reach out to me. Mike Clark, send me an email. Um, I'll send you that code. It's a very, it's, it's very small, though. I mean, it's only only two. Uh, by the way, anyone here is Tube Tycoon. We do have a special... Uh, if you're too, we have a tube tycoon, uh, customers, if you're watching this and you haven't, I do have a very small, uh, a, a customer loyal loyalty, uh, coupon, if you will, uh, it's posted inside the members area inside the, uh, inside the tube tycoon, um, Facebook group, I believe. Oh man, I'm getting tired. Okay, guys. So that's gonna be it for today. Uh, I'll see you. I'll, I'll launch tomorrow is the 9 a.m. release. Uh, Stay on commissions is basically everything you need to know from start, from basement to rooftop. Turn com ClickBank commissions and other digital affiliate networks co commissions in a way that's as natural to you as sleeping, eating, and breathing. Okay, guys. So with that said, I will see you in the follow-up videos and in, inside the uh, Stay, Stay Home Commissions members area. Thanks for coming out and reach out to me if you have any questions. I will see you in the Sam Commission members area.